from Abuja. Who is the prime suspect of the, the cause of the fire outbreak? I said my prime suspect is God. I said G O G. And now said, oh, now God Almighty, you are talking about. We're thinking that this was a human slave. Oh no, prophet, you disappointed us. <laughs> so I am. I'm sorry for everybody. Because it, I'm saying here because my disobedience that caused this fire outbreak. God said that you want to this house. I am not ordinary person. I am not ordinary person that I think you now keep as ordinary and down to your full list of canonic to go. But I'm sorry. Whatever you are watching me, I'm very sorry. Sorry. I'm going to build the house of God. I promise you. You're watching me from America. You're watching me from Asia, from, from Europe, in African countries, and also in Nigeria, whatever place you're watching me from. Please, I promise you. Supposed to be in our father's house today, but because of my stubbornness, so please go. I want every one of you to forgive me. Please, his house. God bless you all. Now to this time, I promise you, you see something you want before. The power, the church of God in Christ's mercy land deliverance ministry. So God bless you, and God bless every one of you. Be happy. Why are you going to be happy today? Don't cry because the Lord has so mercy, He so loved us that He did not take my life. I also give Him this one. We are. This is only you, and the, well, the God Almighty God who are trying, God tried a man called the people that who God tried in the Bible. All of them passed through trial. All the great men of God they passed through trial before they become the great men of God. Yes, sir. But some of them, I don't know what really happened. A trial can come. Some people they are watching me and they are listening to me. Their trial is their house rate. It may be a house rate that you have been passing through. As soon as you come to God, that trial that you have been passing through, God is going to now answer your house rate. That is called the things of God. The people that will pass through trials, there is a way out for them that do know God. Always they are always something about. Why? That trial in order for you people to know that there is God. I want to let your marriage, marriage and never marry, is a trial. As soon as you are going to Jesus Christ, that person that would never marry, people can insult you today, but tomorrow, your trial, because you are crying, calling Jesus Christ, you must have a befitting marriage. Because uh, uh, it is God that sent me to do his work. Uh, whatever thing that, uh, that going around me, uh, it is God that's going to you know, God knows why, uh, whatever challenge that is going on. So I know that the same God that who have uh, taken his property must redeem it again. You know, this inferno that occurred here just affected only the, the building, the partner hall, as you said. And the other building was not affected. What can you say lead to that? Uh, why? Because of that? Because uh, it is... Uh, because I promise God that uh, when it's easy, I come that? to this, uh, this city, the first thing I am going to do, I sh the Lord also showed me that I should build this house before 
you know, build my personal house. But uh, even I have tried it, one of them here, in order to now build my personal house here, but the Lord warned me. I refi I stopped the building over there, right in the city here. The next one, I after some time, I now just go inside town here in Delta States. So I built a house for my wife. That be why that, that building that I built for my wife. Not knowing that it is me, I building the house for myself. Uh, but uh, I was just you know. Because of, uh, I promised God, I just used my wife's name for cover up. But uh, when God, God is the one that who created us, we cannot just, you know, play with, the, we cannot joke with God and we cannot play trick. Also, we cannot deceive God. So that's how um, I, built, I built the house for her. No, it's a mushroom that I built her. So I told her that she should not, you uh, know, she wanted to go and pack back into the house this year, but uh, I stopped her because of what is disturbing me. Because the Lord said, "Build my house, build my house before build your house." So even though before this uh, incident, this uh, fire of the just out, the Lord told me that a week ago he, he said, "When are you going to build my house?" I said, "I'm going to build the house in June this year," but uh, that June. I don't know. That was my plan. But I am very, I'm of a Jew to build the house. What I'm using is the partner's home. That's what we're using. So, so Pastor, sir, you. With us. So, though I'm so stubborn in order to now to build the house, but I, I really stubborn. It's my fault. Okay, sir. In this. Yes, uh, um, my message to all Christian Jim and those who are there. Uh, that carry the microphone, whosoever, the clergymen, women, this message for those people that are out there, I want to let you people know uh, is that uh, anybody that who, who you promise God <laughs> or God promised, God told you that do this thing, if you don't do, <laughs> now you sabi, oh, me, I don't know, I don't know, because I have seen the danger, I've seen the danger. My advice to them is that they should, whatever thing that they hear from God, let them do it. Let them abide by it. Yes, Lost during this incident. There's no, there's no, no, chill, no casualty, no, no inch, or nobody wound, nobody. All, all, all of us safe. Only the property of God has been taken. God has taken his properties. Yes. Sir, sir, very important, quick, very. But I cannot take it, to, you know, or for granted anymore, because Thank I am you. ready. Thank you, sir. Thank you. Um, I, I, what has uh, really happened to me, to the body of Christ, this information to everybody, because what happened to your brother has also happened to me. So, what I'm telling you, one, a wound for one is wound for all. So, I want to now let every one of us uh, that who are there that, uh, you know, worshipping, calling the name Jesus Christ. Um, Job tried it. We have been reading, I've been, even myself, I was reading, I'm reading the Bible, Job. Jonah, sorry, Jonah, 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 Jonah. Not me, see, this time in, in life, Jonah. Uh, that one is the Bible, Jonah. Jeremiah is a life, Jonah now. So please, don't try it. Don't do it. Anything you hear from God, please, I'm begging the Christian Dion. Do it. Do it. So my own is a lesson to all the Christian Dion now because I have disobeyed him. The God has forgiven me. That's why I am ready to build a house. So please, wherever you are, don't take the voice of God, the word of God, and the voice of God for granted. So please, I am still begging you because I know the pains. I know the pains I pass through. Though whatever thing I listen, only the the the, the, the my my what I'm trying, what I'm giving glory to God because there's no casualty. And God provides us. You can see today's service. You can see now all under three days, we are now getting all those things and, and also overflows and rain. So. Thank you very much. I don't want this kind of thing to happen to my colleagues. I don't want it. And I pray, let God begin to guide us and give us wisdom and give us, you know, uh, our there's, take away that stumbling heart, that heart, uh, that heart. Let God begin to give us obedient hearts to serve Him. And God bless you all in Jesus' name. Amen.